Hi, this is Rachel Stone at CCT in Richmond, Virginia, and I'll demonstrate how to create a contact group in Outlook 2013. And all a contact group is, it's a group of people who you email on a regular basis. Uh, but instead of having to select each individual name each time, uh, you can just create a group for them and then just email the group each time. And so I'm currently in my people view, and on the home tab, I'll click new contact group and I need to select the members so I'll choose the add members button and I could choose from my contacts or from my Outlook book and so I'll go with the Outlook contacts and I'll double click just a few names here that I want to add and click OK and if I want to go back and get anyone from my global address book I'll choose from address book and notice that takes me to my global address list and I'll grab one more name and click OK now I'll assign a name to this group here and I'll call this uh, my planning committee and then click save and close. Now my planning committee displays within my contact list, here it is. Notice it has the word group there so that's an easy way for me to see that this is a group instead of a normal contact. Now I'll double click it and I'll see the same uh, screen that I saw before when I created this group and I could easily edit this list if I want to uh, remove someone or add someone else. It's a very simple process. And I'll save and close. Now let's say I'm ready to create a new message to send to this group. So go, I'll go back out to my mail tab to new mail and next to two I'll just start typing planning committee and notice it comes up in my autocomplete so I'll select it there. Um, otherwise, I could click the To button and um, make sure I browse to my contacts and double click Planning Committee and it, it inserts them this way. And that is using a contact group in Outlook 2013. This is Rachel Stone and thanks so much for watching.